the surrender of German forces at Beaugency, France, in September 1944, marks one of the largest and most remarkable capitulations of World War II. This event saw Major General Botho Elster and his troops, comprising over 19,000 soldiers, formally surrender to the Allied forces. As the Allied forces, particularly the U.S. Army's 83rd Infantry Division, advanced through France, German forces under Elster found themselves cut off from retreat and surrounded by a rapidly advancing enemy. Despite the dire situation, the German forces were determined to avoid a bloody confrontation. Negotiations between Elster and the U.S. Army began with the involvement of American officers, including General Robert C. Macon. The discussions were tense, with the Germans initially hesitant to surrender to the French resistance due to fears of retribution for their earlier atrocities in France. Instead, they sought to surrender directly to the Americans. The surrender was eventually negotiated, with the German forces agreeing to lay down their arms at Beaugency, a town on the Loire River. The surrender ceremony was held on September 17, 1944, on the Beaugency Bridge, where General Elster officially handed over his troops, along with a significant amount of military equipment, including hundreds of vehicles and thousands of weapons. This event was highly symbolic. While the formal surrender was orchestrated by the U.S. Army, the French resistance played a crucial role in forcing the Germans into this position, a fact often overshadowed in historical accounts. The event was well documented, with newsreel cameras capturing the surrender, and it remains one of the best-covered surrenders of the war. However, the exclusion of the French resistance from the surrender ceremony sparked controversy and resentment among the resistance fighters, who felt that their contributions were overlooked. This surrender was not just a military victory, but also a significant psychological blow to the German forces in France. It marked a turning point in the liberation of the country, contributing to the rapid collapse of German occupation in the region,